Hey, what's up YouTube? So today there was a release for Mac of the iOS 8.13 to iOS 8.14 or 8.4, sorry. Um, anyways, I've got a restored iPad here to iOS 8.4 and a MacBook and I want to show you guys how to be able to jailbreak using this tool. Um, I have already the link in the description for you guys here. You can download it right from their website. Uh, this is the website here. Once you download it, uh, you'll find the DMG just in your downloads folder. Open it up and drag it over to the uh, applications just like so. And then double click it uh, or you can launch it here from your launch pad. So once you've opened up the jailbreak and I've got it opened up here, you're going to want to connect a device that's uh, not jailbroken, has been upgraded, Wi-Fi turned off, uh, the iCloud, I turned mine off, but all you have to do is turn off the Find My iPhone feature. And then um, passcodes as well, you'll want to make sure that there's no passcode enabled on the device. So this is just a fresh restore, it's just the best way to do it. Uh, so I've connected it to the laptop here, and um, over here, uh, for you guys that are kind of curious, this is a shell kind of dump of what's going on in here. So for you nerds, um, enjoy. Anyways, start the jailbreak. You will be taken here, so it'll basically tell you the things I told you before. Uh, make sure you turn those things off, and we'll just allow the jailbreak to go. So unfortunately there wasn't any use, anything useful here, you just seen the, uh, the backup that was performed, but the device is giving the almost full. And the jailbreak has succeeded. So there you guys have it. You're able to pick up the Mac jailbreak from the website here. We'll just allow the device to reboot. And now you can unlock your device. Uh, you'll get the storage is almost full. Scroll over in uh, Open Cydia. And now this will take about a minute or so to finish loading, so once it's complete, uh, we'll come back here. Alright, so once you come back here, you'll be a, uh, into a respring and then you can reopen Cydia. And uh, from there you'll see you're on the Cydia 1.120, so if you actually go to the refresh, you'll be prompted to update and then you'll have a fully working 8.4 jailbreak. So thanks for watching guys, um, if you have any issues with the jailbreak, if it um, fails or anything, just try again, 
or restore the device. A lot of people are just trying from devices they've updated. They don't want to restore it, but you, sometimes you have to. So, uh, thanks for watching. Here we go. Cheers, guys.